हेलो एवरी वन वी विल कंटिन्यू द टॉपिक ट्रांसपोर्ट ऑर्गेनाइजर एंड इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी क्रिएटेड वन प्रोग्राम एंड वी स्टोर दैट प्रोग्राम इन टू वर्क बेंच रिक्वेस्ट इन टू द डेवलपमेंट सिस्टम नाउ दिस प्रोग्राम नीड्स टू गो टू द क्वालिटी सिस्टम सो दैट फंक्शनल कैन टेस्ट दिस प्रोग्राम आफ्टर टेस्टिंग this program will go to the production system so that customer can use this program so how how we will send this program to the quality and then production system with the help of transport request because transport request is a mechanism by which we can send the objects from one system to another system now now this request this request needs to be imported into the quality system now who will import the request into the quality system or we can say after that in the production system basis is the person who is responsible for all these things because what is basis basis is responsible for whole and soul administration and monitoring of the sap system so we will simply simply connect with the basis person or we will drop a mail to the basis person that please import this request to the quality system so that functional can do the testing now whenever we will connect with the basis person or drop a mail to basis person regarding import of this transport request the basis person will revert us and told that please please release your request because you can see as of now the status of the request is modifiable modifiable if the status of the request is modifiable it can never never import to the other systems so please make sure whenever you are connecting with the basis person regarding import of a transport request please please release your transport request first the transport request status needs to be released if it needs to be imported to the other system now it's a time to dig down into the status of the transport request in the last video we discussed we have two status of the transport request one is modifiable and another is released when we created the transport request the status of that transport request is modifiable so what is modifiable word itself is saying the transport request can be modified up to that level if the status is modifiable means changes can be added or removed from the transport request suppose as of now the status of the transport request is modifiable suppose we want to add one more program to this transport request we can add suppose we want to add one table to this transport request we can add suppose we want to delete something from this transport request we can do if the status is modifiable we can add the objects we can delete the objects from the transport request but the major thing is if the status is modifiable it cannot be import to the other system now what is released status once the transport request is released you cannot go for any further changes to the transport request means you cannot add the object you cannot delete the object you cannot do anything with that transport request but once the request is released the request can be import to the another system so we have two status modifiable and released modifiable means we can go for the changes with that transport request but if the status is modifiable it cannot be import to other system 
released means yes the changes are freezed we cannot go for any more changes to that transport request but it can be import to the other system now what we will do we will see how to release this particular transport request so i will simply put a cursor on to sub task this is the sub task whenever we want to release that transport request the first thing we should release the sub task of that transport request so i'll put the cursor on the sub task and there is a release button i will click on to release and you can see one tick is coming automatically it means the sub task is released now we will simply simply release the main main request it is getting released now i will simply refresh and if i will go to the back button and display please if sub sometimes what happens your release check box is not ticked and people are saying they are unable to see the request if you want to see the release request please tick this check box i will go for display you can see previously this request was the part of modifiable now this request is in released status now whenever we will drop a mail to basis person now basis person can easily easily import the request to the quality or you can say if quality testing is over then he can go for production system also if i will double click you can easily easily see the request status is released now so what is the summary of the video what we studied in this particular video a transport request has two status modifiable and released if the status is modifiable it cannot be imported to other system if the status is released after that only it can import to other system a modifiable request means if the status is modifiable we can go for changes to that transport request but if the status is released the request is freeze now we cannot go for any further changes to that request and we studied how to release that transport request firstly you need to release the sub task then you need to release the main request and once the request is released basis person can easily easily import to the other systems so that we can go for the testing of the same so that's it in this particular video thank you